our pancreas works with our insulin to help glucose get into the cells that's associated with magnesium. So if you have a deficiency in magnesium, everything's affected. The brain, in our brain neurons, there's 86 billion brain neurons. And in each neuron, and neuron just means a cell, in each neuron, there are 2 million mitochondria. And you Mm -hmm. know how often you're hearing about mitochondria these days. Oh, you know, there's, it's so important. It's, well, what's really important about mitochondria is the Krebs cycle. Energy is made, ATP, adenosine triphosphate energy. But what that molecule really looks like is ATP-MG. Your energy molecule doesn't work unless it's attached to magnesium. And nobody- I did can- not know that. I did not know that. So I came, you know, my whole world is, was magnesium, take in everything. But when I look at things through the lens of magnesium, I say, oh, everybody's on about mitochondria. Oh, they must be talking about magnesium. Not a word, not a word. So I'm saying that the dementia, the Alzheimer's, even Parkinson's, it could be related to mineral deficiencies, especially magnesium. 